Hey guys, Phil's Gumball Adventures back with you again. Um, so, I'm doing some routine servicing again. Uh, I've got my bags with me. I got my extended candy, gumballs, um, peanut M&Ms, and Skittles, and anything else that I have got at these other locations that I've got properly marked off like a pussy. I got my table, and then I've got my backpack, so in case I need to take something apart or do a quick repair, it's all squared away. Three locations I'm doing so far are all within a mile of each other and uh, they are recently placed I'm not looking to pull a lot of money out of them I'm just looking to just make sure that everything is kosher and everything that they got what they wanted um, just to, just doing what I can to uh, stay on top of it uh, later on in the next part of this video I'm gonna do a shout out to the businesses that have took my machine um, and properly identify them. I was going to do that during this video, but I want to make sure that I have my phone number straight because I don't usually call them, I just show up. So, in the next part of this video, I'll have that squared away. Just, um, just keep it, keep hitting the road and keep um, asking those people to place your machines and um, don't give up. Keep on getting it. Uh, there's nothing wrong with the business. Um, I'm doing this during my lunch hour, so it's not really overly stressing to me it's a, a quick 20 minutes to knock out three buildings that's basically what it is like I said, it's a routine service no big deal and um, I'm getting my time set for it so that when I do this on a regular I know how long each place takes I know the distance between each place and how long to knock out so roughly 30 minutes of my day will be spent taking care of these three businesses and then when I go to do the other ones, I'll have the other three in a, kind of a circle that I can do as well. And um, as I steadily move up, I'll work them into a pattern too so that they're not all stacked on top of each other and it won't be a struggle. Because again, you don't want to struggle with this. You just want to service them and move on. So, yeah. As long as, uh, as, long as you're doing that, you're taking care of your customer and everything's going to work out all right. And uh, that's what it comes down to, customer service. It's a, even if it's just gumballs, it all makes a difference because people still look at you the same way that you look at them as a business. You know, you're providing a service and they want that service, but they want a professional service. And that's where you come in. So get out there and keep on getting it. Um, there'll be a part two to this in a little bit. I just want to go ahead and take care of them as fast as possible and um, get an idea of the timing I'm going to need on this. So yeah, we'll work it out. In the meantime, this is Phil. Keep selling. All right, guys, I'm back. All right, so that was three locations, 30 minutes tops. Um, I actually kind of hung around one for a little bit, kind of just talking a little bit. And uh, great feedback. I got to say, when you, when you take the time to get to know the people that you're putting the machines in with, they really talk to you. They, they share with you what they like and what they don't like. I'll tell you right now, they love peanut M&Ms. My goodness, that was, uh, it's uh, usually the Skittles. <laughs> Skittles are usually the most popular ones, but peanut M&Ms, man, I tell you, it's the way to go in certain places. Um, just make sure those machines are turning them out proper. I did have one issue. Uh, somewhere along the line, somebody put a nickel in the machine and it began to, it didn't spit it out, instead it hung up and when it hung up the coin mechanism in a u-turn all plastic it's stuck and so every quarter they stuck in after that started slowing the machine down and started messing with the winding that ain't good because that grinds that plastic down and it's a fix that you got to do later i'm glad i caught it in time and i'm glad i did this weekly check because this check saved me some headaches um it, it happened on the peanut slot too of all places and that was the one that was producing a lot. So, got there, um, got the feedback on it. They love the uh, service. They love everything I was doing. Um, and um, yeah, I mean, that was a, it was a good call. I think that particular, this checkup was like a week and a half into it. Um, I can probably show you. So 
So yeah, I mean that's today's haul from just that week and a half. And about 80% of that was from the peanut M&Ms. So I can, I'm, I can live with that, that's not bad. I think overall, if I can get a couple more machines like that in a couple of locations where there's something that's wildly popular, then I'm good to go. But uh, yeah, just keep plugging away, keep getting it. And um, yeah, keep your notes, always keep your notes. I got my pad, I wrote down the customer's name, the time of date, the time of service. I got my route for just these three locations. So I've got that earmarked. I know where I'm gonna go and uh, how I'm gonna do it. I also know what to bring with me so that I'm not carrying a bag full of just everything. And uh, just, you know, I'm in a pickup truck, there's only so much room I got. If you're out there doing the same thing and you got a minivan or a bigger vehicle that you can work out of, then you're blessed and um, that's good. I'm using my truck as best I can to carry what I can. So you gotta plan ahead, always plan ahead. And um, thankfully I've got good support at the house. Uh, my, my wife, she's, she's good at reminding me with my own personal checklist. Can't do it without her. And uh, I'm grateful for, for helping me out with this. If you got somebody helping you, you're even more blessed. So just keep at it. It's a tough road. It's an easy road, but you can do it. One step at a time, one customer at a time, one sell at a time, just keep plugging away. Don't give up. There's, there's still plenty to be had out there. You just gotta go get it. In the meantime, this is Phil. And this is Phil's Gumball Adventures. Just keep plugging away and uh, happy selling. Just keep getting it. Yeah. <laughs>